Hello guys, and welcome to my yearly roundup. Uh, I've never done one of these before, I don't know if I'll do them again, but, uh, you know what, this year I decided to just do a roundup, because this year has been a particularly good year for the channel. Uh, there's no scripts to this, there's no nothing to this, I've just got a few notes of stuff that's happened. So, without further ado, the yearly roundup 2016. Uh, so first, I'm gonna list off all of the Vins that I've let's played, and actually finished. Uh, a surprisingly short list given that it's been a year, but uh, off and on uploads, it it happens. I, I do upload those random videos as well, those random gameplay clips. Uh, I don't know if anyone watches those, but I, I enjoy doing them. It's just something to spice it up a little bit. So this year, at the beginning of the year, we started out with Dawn of War, Dark Crusade as the Eldar. Finish that. Uh, also finished Day of the K, my first ever fan sent in game that I played and completed. Uh, thank you again for sending that in. Uh, I completed the Dawn of War, sorry, uh, the Warhammer 40,000 Space Marine campaign. I did a one-off Let's Play on Lux Lux. I did a one-off Let's Play on Darkest Hour, a Hearts of Iron game, as Luxembourg. I did a two-part Let's Play of GTA V, if it can even be called Let's Play, I just, that was... That was a, a test for my new PC, uh, that became just me messing around in GTA V. Very fun. Uh, Hearts of Iron 4 is Bulgaria. Really good Let's Play. I enjoyed that a lot. Uh, thank you to Games Planet uh, for giving me a copy of that game. Don't know if I'd be... I mean, I'm... Uh, for those who don't know, I'm partnered with Games Planet. Uh, I haven't done anything else. I haven't been in discussions with doing any other games. I haven't really wanted to get any other games to do them. You know, I've got, got a backlog of games I want to do. Uh, so, though I'll probably do other games with uh, them in the future. But, uh, otherwise, yeah. Uh, got Hearts of Iron Bulgaria. Uh, Chroma Gun. The first game I've ever been sent a dev by. Not like Games Plant, with their games distribution pl uh, platform. This was a dev actually sending me a game. Uh, so, yeah. Actually got one of those. Uh, Gone Home, that was like four minutes because I was bored one day. Decent Let's Play, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I did my first ever culling videos with Turbo Dude or Turbo Gaming. Uh, probably gonna do other content with that guy. Great guy. Uh, like I said, expect to see him more on this channel. Uh, yeah. Also, go check him out on his channel. Uh, did the Magic Circle. Great game. The totally accurate battle simulator, and last but not least, Doomstar, another game sent by a dev. All of this happened in 2016. Three of these games I was sent by some- well, actually, four of these games I was sent by somebody else. Which is really nice, that it shows that my channel really has picked up and people are starting to take notice. So, yeah, and uh, the games I'm currently running, of course, is the Dark Sour Hearts of Iron game campaign as Spain. I'm doing a Total War uh, Rome 2 Let's Play as Syracuse. I am doing a Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Tag Force 2 uh, Let's Play. Been on hiatus for half a year. I don't know, I I swapped PCs and then I, I never came back to it. And I just never felt like going back to it. And I, I don't want to force it. it. I mean, it's a... It's sort of a casual game to begin with. I never did it to be particularly funny or... I don't even know if I was trying to be entertained. I just like... I just thought one day, I feel like playing Yu-Gi-Oh. I'll record it and I might as well talk over it for a little bit. Uh, yeah. So, it it is still there. If it's... If you check the About page on my YouTube channel and it says that something's still there, it's still there until a video says otherwise. Uh, speaking of which, Break and Oblivion. Haven't done a video on that this year, I'm pretty sure. Still there! I I still plan on doing videos on that. At least one other fin I want to do on that, but there's other fins that I can do on that. And, of course, new series that just came out. Uh, I, no one saw it coming. I only thought of it like a few weeks ago, because... It's, it's something I've always kind of wanted to do. Uh, not that in particular, but it's the style I've wanted to do for a while. Uh, so, it was the History of the Hounser Dynasty. 
I have no idea if it's a let's play, uh, narrative let's play, scripted let's play, whatever you want to call it. I don't even know if it's anything like that, or if it's just something. Uh, but it's something I kind of want to do. I wanted to. I've always wanted to make sort of a narrative series, and this sort of blends uh, let's play and sort of a scripted story together, you know, I just throw them both together, and, uh, surprisingly good reaction. People really seem to enjoy it, uh, demand an episode two. So episode two will come out at some point next year, hopefully within January of next year. Uh, took far longer to the make than it should, but realistically it should be done in a, at least a month, you know, given time. I'm planning to come back with recording. Like, I know I've been off for three weeks or so. This is a really uns unscripted yearly roundup. Uh, I just got a few notes. Uh, also, yeah, something else I want to bring up. The Evil Dutch Empire animation. Yes, yeah, something that I promised I would at least try and do. <sighs> I, I'm not saying that it's not going to happen, because, of course... I want to see it happen, it's just that I would require a lot of time to just produce one of these fins to a quality that I'm happy with. Uh, I wish I had other people <laughs> helping me. I just wish I had some guy who would make like slides or drawings or something. But yeah, it's a, it's a one-man project and I don't have the time, I, I barely have time to do Let's Plays, or the want to do Let's Plays, uh, occasionally, so, yeah, uh, not saying it's not gonna happen, but yeah. And this year, I got a new PC and mic, that's other things that have happened, so I've upgraded from my, cause, I've had the laptop, that was the beginning, that was the first saga, then I got the PC, and now I've got this PC, far better, can actually record, uh, 60 frames per second, and, uh, you know, full, uh, 1080p, it was a time, for a time I was recording, like, half of that, because I didn't realize that I was for a time, and then it's because it would only work, some games will work if I recorded without that, uh, but this PC can handle a lot of stuff, so I'm really glad I've got it, and it should be able to be upgraded, so yeah, also really quiet, so I don't hear it, and... Yeah, uh, to round off the year, as of today, as of recording, I've got 6,504 subscribers. That is incredible, guys. Uh, I started off with, I want to say, like late 3,000s, early 4,000s. Uh, somewhere in that range, we've managed to gain 2,000 subscribers. That's incredible. Thank you. Thank you to everyone that's tuned in. Even more incredible... We've doubled the views. We had like a million views last year. I've got two million two hundred and odd view. I got the actual number. Two million two hundred and forty-three thousand one hundred and eighty-six views. We've doubled the views in one year. That's incredible. I don't know how we did it, but somehow we've doubled the entire views of the channel in one year. And what? Uh, increase the audience by like a third. That's, that's incredible. This year has been pretty good for the channel. And I'm hoping that it'll continue. Uh, I want to make... I want to continue making Let's Plays, obviously. Uh, I hope... The, the whole thing with the history of the Hounds of Dynasty, though, is I want to make other content. I want to make uh, scripted content. I don't want to just make straight gameplay footage with commentary. I want to have a bit of editing in there. I want to have a bit of a story in there. You know, like the Evil Dutch Empire and stuff, you know? Because that's kind of the... That's kind of the far end of a let's play in the beginning of a narrative because uh, even in those things I would have uh, like little scenes like when I was handed a note I would, that, like that's that's completely out of the game that's not playing the game at that point I'm just making up my own stuff but that's always the funnest part and people agree that that's sort of the best part it's what makes the series when I just kind of make stuff up and yeah that's uh, what I'm hoping to do more of. I want to just make more scripted stuff. It, it'll take longer, but I... It's more satisfying uh, than just doing a straight Let's Play, but obviously love doing those as well. And I will hopefully get back to those. 
I'm looking at you, Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Tag Force 2. I will get back to you. And Break in Oblivion. Promise you. 2017, the year of getting back to something. At some point. Anyway, that is it. I've rambled on for 10 minutes now. God knows what I'm gonna put in front of this uh, footage, of this uh, audio recording, because currently I'm just recording this on Audacity, so... Uh, I'll find some gameplay or something to throw in front of this, I don't know. Uh, you'll know before me, because I, I'll think of it after I finish recording. But in any case, thank you guys for making this a great year. And, uh, yeah, see what 2017 has for us. So thanks for watching, and have a happy new year, guys. Later.